over in Berlin. Now, over the next decade, the Irish economy will continue to outpace the Eurozone. That's according to some economists who are confident that Ireland will weather higher rates and scorching oil prices. The CEO of Anglo-Irish Bank shares their optimism. Well, the Irish economy has outperformed uh, many economies over the last um, five, ten years. You're growing at an average of about eight percent over that period of time. Forecasts for the economy are going forward are between five and six percent. It's been a demographic story. Um, a lot of young people coming through. Baby boom of the 70s and 80s is trans translating into consumers and house buyers at this stage. Um, so strong story there and should be good out over the, over the medium term. Joining us now for analysis is Robbie Kelleher from Davis and Steve Goldstein, the markets reporter from Market Watch. Gentlemen, thank you very much indeed for joining us. Steve, I'm going to start with you here in the studio. Come on then, how are the Irish managing to do this? It's excellent years of it's growth, amazing. it would seem, one after the other. Yep. Uh, in 2004, they grew 4.9 percent. You look around Europe, nowhere, nowhere else is growing nearly as much. A lot of it is simply population growth. Um, everywhere in, else in Europe, people are talking about pension time bombs, slowing populations, not in Ireland, both within the country, their own you know, fertility rate. Plus, they've been very aggressive in taking immigrants from Eastern Europe and adding that to their economy. So that's been one of the big propellers. And then you also have to look at the regulatory environment. Corporate tax rates there are 12.5%. That lures in uh, a lot of capital from abroad, particularly from the U.S. Um, and that's really helped uh, set the foundations for this uh, tremendous, you know, so-called Irish tiger growth story. For sure. And you see it continue.